Hi guys, this is Rishabh Kapoor from websofttutorials.com. In this video guys, I will show you that how can you work with date and time in PHP. Guys, an inbuilt function is used to display date and time. And the name of the function is date. And you can see, this is a inbuilt function. And in between these two brackets, we will use double quotes or single quotes, whatever you want to use. And firstly, I'll write D, D for day, then M for month, and then hyphen or forward slash, whatever you want to use. You can write it something like this, day, month, and then here. Now I will echo it up. Echo date. Go to browser and refresh 18th. Today is 18th and uh, it's uh, January, so it is displaying 1 and 2014. You can also use hyphen instead of for, for slash here. You can see. Now, guys, if you want to print the name of the day, like today is Saturday, so I will use capital D. You will see Saturday is SAT. And then I will use capital M for month. It's Saturday, January, and I will use capital Y. It will display 2014. Now, guys, with this uh, using same uh, we, uh, with using this same function, we can also print the time as well. For that, we will write H capital H, and then colon whatever you wanna use means uh, mostly the colon is used with time. Then I for minutes and S for seconds means H is capital. I and S is small. Now we will go to browser and refresh. You can see 11 to L and uh, second is 56. You can see it's changing. Now guys, if I will see here, uh, the time is 4.43, uh, but it is displaying 11.13. Means uh, we need to set its uh, time zone to a local time zone. So for that, what we need to do, you need to write some a, a line of code here. So we'll write date underscore default underscore time zone underscore set. Now you can see, and in between these two brackets, we will write our time zone here. So we will use double quotes. Now. You can see this website php.net manual slash en time zones dot asia dot php means you can select your uh, means if you're from Africa you're from Ameri uh, America you can select it from me I'm from Asia so I'll it's uh, Asia uh, Asia selected now you can see I'm from India so I'll select Asia Kolkata if you're from Pakistan you will use Karachi if you're from uh, Dubai you will use Dubai if you are from Sri Lanka you will use Colombo so in this way you can uh, set the time zone to your local time zone so I will set it here now that time zone is set to my uh, local time zone means I'm from India and it is set to India now we will go to browser and refresh now you can see 1644 and it's displaying the right time now but if I want to print 4 here what do you need to do you need to write small h and you will see 444 now you can see so I will use capital H here means in this way you can work with date and time means if you don't want to display the date you just need to remove it just display the time guys this date and time function is very useful because with this you can make the record of a user means when the user was registered uh, the last logging time of a user means in this way you can uh, use this date and time in your website so guys if you still have any question you can go to my discussion forum or you can leave a comment below so thanks for watching this video guys don't forget to subscribe my channel to get recent updates about my videos let's see in the next video